Kia ora koutou. Um, I'm Shane Hooks from Elmwood Intermediate School. Um, this week we've been celebrating Matariki across our kura. So we've had a big focus for a four week celebration. Um, our students have been immersed in a, a variety of activities across the week. Been rotating from teacher to teacher and each activity is to do with Matariki and celebrating the kaupapa behind that. Um, students have lo absolutely loved it, it's been great, it's been good to see the culture represented across the kura um, and lots of the activities are hands on, the students are learning skills, they're engaged in the lessons and they're also learning about um, the Matariki stars, what it means, the new year, they're reflecting on things that have gone in the past and how to start fresh and set some goals for the remainder of the year coming up. Hello, um, we are from Elminster Intermediate and this week we've been focusing a lot around um, Matariki and this here is one of our Matariki um, activities that we're doing. So basically we are building a one metre square. We're down in the forest right now behind our school and we're having a look at what we can find here, what is living and what should be living down here. We've made like a little square uh, to the side of us and we've got to like look at all the plants that are r around the square. So we've got like native kawakawa and we found lots of little bugs and stuff. Um, and there also is behind, uh, or just in front of us, is a nice stream going down there, which, well, we think should be a lot more freshwater animals such as the crayfish and that, just in yes. there and being nice and clean. Uh, so basically the game is poi tour. It's a, game, a Māori traditional game where you have to throw the poi down the field towards people holding the poles. And if you, the people holding the poles catch it, then you get a point. So most of the people, you must have your like awesome defense, you know. If you're like not on defense, then other team will score. Nice. But uh, if you have good, good attitude and a good mindset, then you'll be able to win. I did a kōru and stars because it's represented by Matari. I did the nine stars and the accordion stuff. When you use the kites, um, sending a message to loved ones that have passed on. I did a surfboard because we see the Matariki stars a lot in Gisborne and there's lots of surfing in Gisborne. Today we've been doing Matariki rotations because this year is the first year where Matariki is a celebration all around New Zealand. Today we done music um, based around Matariki and yesterday um, we went down to Nahiri to go look at things like trees and different foliage down there. Matariki is a time to come together with your friends and family and celebrate just and maybe have a feast, have some food, spend time with people. Yesterday I got to make some cookies in my Matariki and then we got to decorate them. They meant like a new year and we were reflecting, the art that we made, we were reflecting on the Māori New Year and reflecting on the past year. I really enjoyed it this week. It was really fun. Um, one of our big focuses this year um, as a kura is looking at our um, cultural curriculum. Um, one aspect of that has been our school pepiha. So we had our komato abani um, done our pepiha for us um, at the start of the year and the students have been learning that pepiha in, in, in terms of a waiata. So a waiata has been put towards that and that's been a big focus for us for our identity and where the kids are from, what we are as a kura and what we stand for and then how can we build off that platform and um, build that culturally responsive curriculum as we move forward. Kia ora whanau, this is our Matariki week and we will be doing our school pepiha.